Hello and welcome to a video on how to use the chamfer tool in AutoCAD. I'm Sean Gibson and I will be teaching you how to use this tool. To start out, we're going to just make a rectangle, any size, it doesn't matter. And then we're going to go into, into the uh, modify tools to select chamfer. You're going to select it down here. And what chamfer does is it bevels the edges of your objects. So for the two options that we have that we're going to be using today is the distance and the angle option. The distance option, you're going to enter in two distances. So the first distance we're going to use is a distance of one. Then the second distance will be a distance of two. And then you're going to select your first line. That will be correlated with the first distance that you put in for the, for the chamfer. Then you're going to select the second line that is going to be the second distance. And you could see here that the distance from here to here is the first distance of one. And from here to here is the second distance of two. So we can do that again, but with a, a larger distance. So we're going to do a distance of five and a distance of nine. This is the line we want for the first distance, and then this is the line we want for the second distance. And you could see before I click it, you'll get a view of what the chamfer will look like before you actually do it. And again, you could see that the distance from the second line to the edge is nine, and from the, e the edge to, to the first line is five. The other type of chamfer we can do is an angle. It's very similar to the first one. You're going to enter a chamfer length for the first line. We're going to make it four. But then you're, it's going to ask you for an angle. And this angle will be the angle of the chamfer to the second line from the distance of the first line. And we're, for this one, we're going to do a chamfer angle of 45. So then you're going to select your first line. We're going to make it this line down here, and then you're going to select your second line, and it will make your chamfer for you. So see, this is a perfect 45 degree angle, and the distance from this point to this point is 4, and then it's a perfect 45 degree angle to the second line. Thank you for watching.